Can I buy some storage units? They look like trash. I'm not asking for permission. I'm asking for forgiveness. We're buying it. I've already bid on it. Oh, confirm bid now. Sorry, try again. You must bid at least the minimum amount. We might be able to steal some storage units. Being Black Friday, I just assume that nobody is out there bid, you know, bidding on storage units right now. So it's like I'm the high bidder. I normally have a hard time with this website, Storage Treasures. Hopefully today it's working properly. It's, it's like it doesn't register my bid sometimes. Or I put in a bid and then it, then it says I'm the high bidder and then I watch the auction go down to zero. Then I find out that I'm not the high bidder anymore. They really need to revamp this website. But we're going to give it a shot today. We're going to see if we can get some inventory before Christmas. So what, what I do is when I go to the... When I go to Storage Treasures, right, this is the storage unit that I'm buying from. So if I'm gonna buy one storage unit from that place, I wanna see how many other storage units are there. So you can see this place has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven different units on auction today. So I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna try to bid on as much, get, get all the, the, the decent ones, the ones that, that aren't so bad, the ones that look like they might have stuff to resell. I wanna see, both of these are broken, is there? You get a discount on them? Sure, I'll give you 10 bucks off them. I got outbid on the $160 one, so let me raise that bid to 200, see what happens. We're in the lead on four different auctions, 220, 170, 120, and $80. We got two minutes left to go. But every time somebody bids, they add another five minutes onto the auction. So it's not, it's not like eBay where you can snipe auctions. Uh-oh. See, look, at this is what I'm talking about. Look at what it's saying now. I'm the high bidder on all of them. It says closes in expired. Let's refresh this, see what's going on. Okay, now it's back. So I'm still the high bidder. I got outbid on this one here. I had to un up my bid on the elephant butts. But we're at the we're at $320 now. Let's see the other ones. We only got a minute, little over a minute left. Come on now. This is the problem. Sometimes it just keeps getting extended and extended. Uh-oh, eight seconds, seven, five, four, three, Two, one. Now, if they show me, okay, this says expired. We should be the high bidders on these. Let's go to my account. They're not in there yet. See, see, didn't you, didn't we just watch that end? We just watched that end, didn't we? And now it says, I've been outbid. We're gonna do the law averages. We're gonna pay as much as we can and hope one of them pays off. Just one of the four pays off. Damn it, we got outbid again on the elephant butts. Let's see if they got more money than me. Eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. We all saw that, right? Expired. I would assume that means I won it. Nobody else bid, outbid me. Let's see, my account, one auction. 26? Yeah. All right, so we did win one so far. I won this one too. So far we won, no, we won three. Oh, we just won that one, right? Here's a, th we won one, two, three, four, five, six. Did I bid on those? 460. We, so we just watched this one close. Why does somebody want this unit? Nine, eight, seven, seven six, six, five, four, three, two, one, and we won. When I come back tomorrow, please, I want this still to be clean, okay? Sorry, I work 15 properties. You're okay. We are very patient people. This is our $30 one. Okay, so the cheapest, no, the cheapest was 10. Yeah, cheapest was 10, yeah. Nike Airs! No, right away, Nike Airs. Oh, my brother's gonna like this one. Oh! What's that? Curry's. Pretty sure, number 23, who's 23? Michael Jackson. <laughs> Michael Jackson. 30 bucks was too cheap. Okay. A TV. That's nice. And then 12, 16, it's gonna be at the beginning. Sorry, this property really is a mess. Do you want me to do that? I think it's okay. I don't use the red ones, I don't like them because they're really hard. Somebody else is. Stand it, you just go buy a wreath? Yeah. I smell like something's burning. We're doing lock cuts for December oh. auctions right now, so that's why you're smelling. Yes. They're finding new goodies for next month. A Mercedes Benz. You get toilet paper, right? You load it up, put water in this. It soaks the t 
the toilet paper and shoots it. Anything else that I can do for you? Nope, I think we're good right now. Okay, perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. All right, so we bought the seven storage units. We're here, we just unlocked them all. I think I'm in it total for like $1,200, $1,300. My goal is to find one item out of all seven units that pays for everything, one item. Normally they take a $100 deposit to make sure you clean them out. This lady was super nice here at the storage unit. Yes, I might have been flirting. Don't put that on camera. So that couch is like one of the uh, one of the Ashley couches that we buy, right? That has the, the wireless charging for your phone. I mean, this is a nice unit. Look, we got a nice table set, nice chairs. If this is in good shape, that's a, like a two, that's like a $3,500 couch. You know, we, we can probably get $1,500, $1,800 yeah. out of it. Just not sure about the condition of it. Blushes. Oh, those are, like, those are the Nikes. Those are oh. 160 to 200. You want smalls first? We need any smalls we can get, guys. Oh, it's a couch and a love seat. Look at that. Please be in good condition. Yeah, there's a little bit of wear right here, but I mean, I'm not dissatisfied with it. It's a couch and a love seat. Here's their bed, their headboard, footboard. We got the kitchen table. There's some of their clothing. Or look at this. So this is one of those beds that has the drawers inside of it. You know, look at, look at the dresser. Man, this bedroom set's gonna be about a thousand bucks. This is a great unit. We paid 460 for this unit. Looking at it right now, it's looking like we're getting two, three, probably $4,000 out of this unit. Definitely a home run. It's a great start. It's a great start. So like I said, I paid 12 or $1,300 for everything. I wanted to find one thing that would pay for everything. Boom, couch and love seat right there. Pays for everything, everything. We're gonna get two grand for that, man. This is, this is a great deal. I don't know why we don't do more of this kind of stuff, Ace. Yeah, we should. Hey, here's another set of airs. Look at that one, that, fit, that might fit Tobe. Another pair of Nikes. You know, they could definitely afford all the Nikes in the world, but they couldn't afford to pay their storage unit. You feel bad if they had little kids, but Spider-Man, some jeans, some nude pants. Every storage unit has a jug of change and female pleasuring devices. I promise you every single one of them. So we got a, got a Gucci wallet, man, huh? Think there's any money in there? A lot of jewelry. Look at all this jewelry. Fancy jewelry. I'm surprised how well just box springs sell. There must be people everywhere that just have a mattress and a floor. See, some people don't like furniture and storage units because they don't have the, the facilities to move it. But I mean, with our store, this kind of stuff is gold, right? Great inventory. What's up, buddy? Anything good over there? Okay, so you know, I the inside 65 inch Roku TV. Ho, 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 ho. This is what we need. Paul, do not break this TV. Last thing right here. So this one we bought for $10. We saw the old PS2. It's PS3 and PS4. I would bet you that's 50, 50 bucks, right? No, that's brand new one sell for 300. We got the TV there. We got a 42 inch TV here, although it's a Westinghouse. That's probably worth, I don't know, 60, 70 bucks. There's a refrigerator here. This is worth about 60 bucks. Bunch of miscellaneous stuff. Tyson, pick that up. So all in all, I think we have 50, 100, 200, 300, and we got about $400 worth of stuff here for how much? $10. You bet what? Oh you bet what? Wow. And that's one of the new ones. That's one of the new iPads. Wow, look at that. Happy second birthday. Oh man, poor little kid. A bunch of Christmas crap. We found the iPad, the 65 inch TV, all the shoes, um, you know, dishes, couch set, bedroom set. I mean, all in all, I bet you we got twelve, fourteen hundred dollars for the stuff. We paid one fifty. Of course, this is a home run. He shoots. He scores again. No, that's not the right one. You got this. the ball. He runs. <laughs> oh my God. Oh hell no. So, oh, he was right. Oh, that's these. What are these, man? These are Ooh. nice. Look at these pink these Jordans. Jordan ones. Yeah, these are nice. Uh, Someone really likes Nikes. A cracked iPhone 6, so. Or maybe that, that might just be the uh, protector. <laughs> Toby, you want to take this home with you? Hey, this is where women hide all their deepest secrets in their panty drawers. Except for this lady. We have gotten more doggone shoes. Oh, the last one, we paid 170 on that last one. I probably think we probably got about $500 worth of stuff out of that one. I don't think it was that great. We did get the iPhone 6 with the broken screen. We can get that fixed. We get it fixed for free in our store. So that might be worth 100 bucks. Yeah, the curved screen monitor is gonna be 150 bucks. Get, get the cart to Yeah, it's probably about $500 of the merchandise we got out of there. For some reason, people who, uh, who don't pay their storage units have lots of shoes. 
Matter of fact, I'm gonna up what we're gonna, we can, we can probably get three or $400 just out of the shoes out of that unit. There were so many good shoes. A brand new Adidas bag. Oh. So what? Those are, Those are Jordan 4s. How do you know which Jordans they are? Home oh, theater system. Oh, oh. Nothing. A Rubik X1000 5.1 home theater system. And also home theater system. How much did you say we paid for this? A hundred bucks. We got some Vaseline here for you, Toby. What? There's a Gucci slide in there. What's a Gucci slide? Gucci. Oh, that's An original cool. Gucci slide. That's Oh, Jordan 5 Chicago! Another box. That looks like your size, man. Oh, seven. Oh, look at those. Oh! Oh, these are the Jordan 8 trios. What is going on with this? This unit just this unit is just keeps giving. It's like Santa Claus. It just keeps giving and giving. So, oh yeah, it's in here. So, okay, oh man, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, so that last one, what did we get? 30 or 40 pairs of Jordans out of there. Sneakers, clothing, new with tag stuff, the Cricut cutter. I mean, I guarantee you that's over, well over $1,000. I, I would even venture to say $1,200 of the merchandise in that one. We paid 100 bucks for that unit. And we are getting a ton of good clothing, a ton of good shoes, I mean, out of all of these units. It's insane. It's totally insane. Now, this one is our last unit. We paid $350 for this unit. I don't know why. This is the second most we paid. I think it was because of this ECS tuning thing right here. I wasn't sure what it is, but it feels like an empty box. How much room's on the truck? None. I know you're gonna be shocked, but there might be another pair of Air Jordans here. <laughs> I'm telling you, I think we got a lot of value out of that stuff. I mean, even just in, if you just took the sneakers we got, we got thousands of dollars of the sneakers. Nice. Dude, and not to mention, bedroom set. what was the best things we got? Yeah, the bedroom set, bedroom the set TV, the couch the set with the, with the the Jordans. We got the 65 inch TV, we got an yeah. iPad, but that's why I like to buy so many because the law, you know, if, you, if we would have just bought like this last one, we'd been like, ah, we didn't do so well on that. But you know, buying seven, you know, it, one of them's gonna bound to hit, hit good. And, and we luckily out of seven, I think we had like four or five decent, really decent ones. Yeah, what, what, I mean, I'm guaranteed, I mean, we spent 1200 bucks, 1300 bucks. I guarantee you there's over, over $10,000 of the merchandise in there, easily. So it was a good day, Paul. Good day. All right. Good day. <laughs>